How to reduce keyword clicks and background noises in OBS Studio is what I'm going to show you in this video. So first off, start by opening up your OBS and clicking settings in the bottom right. Now this window pops up. Now you want to navigate to audio on the left. Click that. Now what you want to do is you want to change the sample rate to 48 kilohertz, the channels to stereo, and you're under global audio devices make sure your mic is the one you're using as your microphone currently so mine is called mic which is the hyperx 7.1 audio once you have that you need to make sure that you go down to advanced under monitoring device you need to tick the disable windows audio ducking this is important you can then hit apply and click ok this might prompt a OBS restart, but that's okay. Just do that, click OK. The next step would be to go down to your audio devices, right click your speaker icon in the bottom right on your taskbar, click sounds. Now go over to recording and locate the mic you're using currently or in order to record audio, right click it, Click Properties. Now once you're here, go over to Advanced and make sure under Default Format you set the Hertz amount to the same you just put it on on OBS, which is 48,000 because Kilo is 1,000. Click Apply, then OK. OK again. Now the last thing you want to do in order to remove background noises and reduce your keyboard clicks in OBS would be to open up OBS and locate the audio mixer in the bottom center. Now go to your mic and aux 2 in my case and click the settings icon or cogwheel next to the audio mute button. Left click and then filters. Now you want to add noise gate and suppression, noise suppression by clicking the plus icon in the bottom left and adding noise gate and noise suppression and under noise gate you will have the close threshold and the open threshold you will have to make sure that the open one is below your mic tolerance as you can see here um, for me it's around 40 50 so i have mine at minus 46 decibels the close one doesn't really matter and for the noise gate, I would recommend RNN, RN noise, which is good quality, needs a bit more CPU usage, but you can probably handle that. These are the best options for filters for your mic. That's it. That's all you got to do to reduce keyboard clicks and background noises in OBS Studio. If this video helped you out, leave a like, comment and subscribe. Bye.